we have certain lived experiences and when you have certain experiences your your outlook is very different to somebody else and people don't take into consideration that actually the way you see the world is very different different to the way someone else sees the world and then you're being judged on for seeing it one way but you never had any control over that you know and if you're constantly in survival mode you don't even know what it's like to be peace you don't even know what it's like to not have to worry about money and bills the first thing we have to think about is how are we going to pay the bills can we afford to to live you know we have to look at the next day we have to look at finances we have to plan ahead we're never able to relax and so I think it's important that you know when others you know who've never had to struggle who've never had to um or in that way in terms of survival like you don't appreciate what a blessing is to have a roof over your head to have cooked hot food to be able to have a shower to be able to you know even have a mobile phone or have money on your oyster even even have money in your bank like until you're in a position where that is a luxury it is quite daunting and then you're also being judged as a young person for something that you didn't even it wasn't even your choice and then the corporate parents who meant to look after us and be there for us it seems like when you hit 18 they're nowhere to be seen and then depending on where you live, it's kind of like a postcode lottery and not every service knows about other organisations that can help and support you. And so the fact that they don't work together is a problem and is an issue because, you know, if there are services out there that are meant to help and support us, we should, they should all work together to help us because, you know, we're going to grow up and we're going to be next generation. And if we're not okay, you know, and we're not, we haven't healed, we haven't been supported, it's going to affect you know, the future, and it's going to affect people around us. So I think it's important to invest in young people, you know, to help and support them as they should, because that is their duty as our corporate parents, um, to make sure that we're safe, happy, you know, heard. And it's a shame that we have to get advocates and for fight on our behalf if we know about advocacy. And, you know, a lot has to change.